the qi is more profound as the vocabulary, as the energy. Generally speaking, if we say the energy, I'm going to make energy and the qi are interchangeable, so they are changed, right? The qi is energy, energy is qi, but in order to meet this requirement, qi is energy, energy is qi, we all have to agree these four things. First, all the qi or all the energy contain information, right? Like data, information, right? Everything's energy, for example. You look at the tree, tree is energy. So if a tree is energy, tree contain information. What is information? It's depend on what you want to get, right? It's information. Chemical components, how many years, what kind of trees, right? I, are they poison ivy or can I touch it? Do I allergic to that, right? So you have the, all that is called the information, right? That's the one of the thing. Information is the data. The second one, it's a force, the power, right? What they can do. If that's a tree, tree can turn, if a tree burn it, then cause the transform to the fire. Fire can accumulate the heat. Heat is what? Power. He can do something, right? So everything, if that's energy, they always contain the power, force. How many years takes this tree to grow, which is how many years the time and the energy accumulated in the, this tree, right? So the force and the power is in the other elements in the chi or in the energy. The third one is called the wisdom. If it just give you information, it's useless, right? You want to know, does this information can help me? Otherwise, why you need too many, you know, too much information? You can accumulate a lot of information, a lot of data. So what are you gonna do? Your cell phone, the memory is limited. Why you need so much memory? You just want something useful, right? So you keep some people's the name and the phone number into your phone for for what? Because he or she is useful, right? Otherwise, you delete. Right? You don't want to put someone's phone with someone's name no useful to your phone number. You want the data, information, useful. But that useful also means it has a wisdom, not just a power to help you. It's the wisdom. What's called a wisdom here? We define the, what called a wisdom. In my opinion, wisdom is not information. It's not a force. You can have information, we all got, I, I believe all you guys have all degrees, college, you know, P, PhD, two PhD, two, you know, the, the master degree. So degree just what? Data, information, piece of paper. But can you use this degree? Change your life, right? Can you read the book? It's information, turn this information, make your life change. And then that is the wisdom. Otherwise, just information, right? Information, just data, it's knowledge. Knowledge, you can go to library, go, you can go to internet, you can find this information, but still not yours. You have to digest, you have to transform, right? You have to manifest in your life, turn it to the different things. Then that things, that information come out of your mouth has a wisdom because what? You done it, you been there, you done it there, you have experience. That experience is real, right? You cannot read the noble, you read the, the beautiful love story, the book, and then you say, I know what is called the love, right? You have to go through the crazy love, and then you say, oh, I know the love, but still not enough. You only know one, right? So that's why after you divorce, you still want one more, because you're not satisfied. You still keep looking for new, right? Why? It's unlimited. That's wisdom, right? So, the number fourth, when we talk about this chi, when we talk about uh, this energy, in the Chinese vocabulary, what is the chi? 
is the the most important is the universal life. Let me repeat it one more time. It's the universal life. What does that mean? So when I say, oh, you don't have a chi, so what does that mean? That means inside of you, when I look at you, I don't see any signs of the universe. It's scary, right? When someone says, where, where are you? Where you come from? I didn't see any signs. You doesn't look like your parents. That's scary, right? You're alien. <laughs> right? <laughs> that's right, where you come from. You can't say that. So that's why when you don't have a chi, what's that mean? That means you are missing the universal life inside of you. The last one is very important. What is the universal life? That's called the life. We make this whole universe still life, have a life. Still at the there is the life, it's the wisdom, it's the force, it's the information. That's called the universal life. Therefore, each one of the us is the image of the universal life. So that's why when the Chinese medicine coming into this reality, when they deal you, they don't deal your disease. They deal your relationship between you and the universal life. That's the beauty of the Chinese medicine. They deal the life. We are not deal the disease because it's about universal life, right? So if you understand the qi, then you will understand what is called the qigong. Okay? You heard of this name many times. People say, oh, you practice qigong. What do you practice? Oh, I practice qi and the force and make you feel good. That's nothing. You know, why bother? Right? Just buy the drug, buy the pills, take it. You want to chi, you got the energy, you want to hide, get the something. Much easier. A real practice the universe, by practice what we call the qigong, is you practice yourself. Allow universal life can go through you, can show more, just like you clean the mirror. Why? You want to reflect yourself, right? You want to can see. And then yourself will become life mirrors. You are the life mirrors reflection of the universe. That's the Qigong purpose. Make a universal life inside of you can show more. So that's why when someone says, I practice Qigong 30 years or 40 years, so what do you see? I see you look like just nothing. So then what is the universal life? Because the life always show. Look at the truth. Either you life or you dead, right? Beauty is beauty. Wisdoms, information. You look at each gun, beautiful. Now it's time. Information. Why they change? They receive the message for the universe. It's time to change, right? So the color change. That's information. That's the force of the time. Color change. Color is energy, right? Wisdom, so they know it's time to change a color. When they change a the color, you know that's a universal life still in the maple tree because it's represented for the life. Now look at yourself. Can you be like a tree? Can you change it like that way? Yes, you just doesn't see that. You never look like yourself. You never, you forget about it. You are the child of the universe. We forget about the this. We are the child of the universe. So therefore, we're missing the this. We never connect to these things. We're looking for the superficial stuff. So in order we can real connect, reconnect this, so we have to understand who we are. 